Rocky Five, our event coming up tomorrow. What time is that happening? Well, it, I mean, uh, it opens at 11 tomorrow, the same as our Switch meetups, where we have a Splatoon 2 tournament, just saying. And uh, I don't know if anyone else wants to hop on commentary here, but uh, we're certainly going to... Uh, certainly people jockeying for position for the end, our send-off to Smash 4. Uh, you got to think that, uh, veritably, you have your favorites. You have Juice, potentially six. We got someone jumping on commentary with me for this... Uh, Winners round two matchup between Delhi and Beast, who uh, Beast, the uh, one half of the doubles champions, alongside Juice, who we saw get taken to the very limit against Wawa Peach. Yeah. My goodness. That was a wild set off stream, but uh, Juice ended up clutching it out. Uh, let's focus on this match now. Dang, Delhi going to uh, puff against Beast's Fox. This is actually interesting because uh, um, if Puff can get Fox off stage, that's actually pretty huge. The problem will be, of course, Fox's buttons are so good that it's hard to get him, get him off stage consistently as Puff. Pretty amazing to see. And yeah, Beast, we Ooh. saw... Oh my goodness gracious! Yo, why didn't he go off stage? <laughs> I mean, I mean that was Deli playing it, uh, playing it maybe a bit too safe. Mm. He does, We have seen him play Puff in the past. And I think the past three weeks, and that up smash doing work for Delhi. Yo, and that worked because he crossed him up right there. He hit his shield and completely crossed him up, so he went for the up smash out of shield. He just said, hey, you're going to whiff this up smash, up tilt, you're dead. Great stuff by Delhi. Whenever I, see, whenever I hear cross them up, I think of Criss Cross, the hip-hop group. <laughs> and I don't know why. I really don't. But I just know that uh, that everything's to the back with a little slack because inside out is wiggity, 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 oh, whack. Yo, why oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, he missed the rest. And the up smash yeah. will do the job yeah. for, uh, for Beast. He uh, yeah, still he has some work to do, but yeah, he's not hurting. impossible. Oh, my gosh. Yo, did he sing? <laughs> This boy's I think crazy. he did, yeah. Oh my god! Oh my goodness! A lot of potential for punishing here, and uh, yeah, not the best place for Delia to be in if you're going to be. He <gasps> did work him up for. Why does he keep doing that? It look, 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 Beast is obviously aware of that option now. You've done it uh, three of three of your times that you're going out for an ed that you could be oh, going out for an edge. Oh, air dodges! Go for it. Oh, and he does catch a. Yeah. Uh, does catch Beast on the edge, looking for that stage bike, but he's at 133. It's not impossible for Delhi. Oh, and we're seeing, that's it. oh, and the yeah. up smash will do it. And Beast takes the first game. That was a, that was a wild one. Yeah, that was actually a nail biter at the end there. But it, Delhi just playing it too, playing it too like unsafe at the end there. He was trying to uh, put pressure on Fox when in actuality, all the only pressure he really needed to put on Fox was just to stay on the other side of the stage and say, "Hey, you have to come to me," because he had the percent lead, and he was he could crouch lasers. Fox can't pressure him in that way, so he really. He really had every opportunity to let Beast make the mistake, but instead he decided to approach a little bit unsafely. I just realized that we haven't introduced you to the stream yet, so yo, go ahead, mate. Yo, I'm Turtle Hands. <laughs> Absolutely, Your mate. local local Game & Watch main, doing his work. <laughs> Absolutely, good to have you, Turtle Hands. But right now we're going to have Game 2 of Round 2 winners, Delhi and Beast. And uh, Beast... Oh, wow, we see a little bit of a change here. It's, yeah, that's about as diametric a change as you can get from Jigglypuff to Ganondorf, isn't it? Oh, yeah, definitely. Fast in the air and light light to heavy and slow in all capacities. But definitely a heavy hitter. If he can get, uh, I mean, again, if he can get Fox off stage, Ganon has a long-lasting Nair that can intercept side B. He can, yeah, he's just not going off stage. That's fair. He wanted to opt for the ledge trap there. I, I Not wanted, at this percentage. Yeah, I wanted to see. I want to see him at least go off stage once because Ganon's uh, edge guard tools are really good. But then the recovery's not there. Yeah, Beast hitting hit him right out of his double jump there, so he did not have any options left to recover. I mean, it's uh, especially with Beast moving around with Fox the way that we saw him. I mean, doing a lot of really good work alongside oh. Juice and doubles. And uh, he's going. I mean, Delhi's going to have to make some incredible reads in order to get the best of, uh, in order to get the best of Beast here. Good job on the, on the <laughs> forward smash, but and he does catch the edge. But man, you do not want to be under Fox in the air. That is just oh, not Ganondorf's territory. He's yeah, he's done. Yeah, he's done. You're absolutely right. 
And Delhi uh, certainly had an idea <laughs> in mind. What was the thinking behind that, do you think? Yeah, I mean, he, he probably figured that uh, he was in Beast's head for a good majority of that game, and Ganon is a character that really thrives off of reads. So he was just like, okay, if I was in his head for a little bit, I can make a few good plays with Ganon and bring this around. But opting to go for an option like Dare to cover his side B, Dare isn't active for very long. You want to do something like Nair because that covers that covers the side B and sends A lot of out. range as well. Yeah. Yeah. It, it's a really good move for edge guarding. You know, it's funny that I mentioned Jigglypuff and Ganondorf being diametric opposites, but mm -hmm. at the same time, they're both characters that really thrive on predictive play. Oh, definitely. Yeah. So, so in that case, very much one in the same. That is so weird <laughs> to say. Yeah, definitely. But, 